Welcome to Room 6, the channel dedicated to the local music scene and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and today I've been asked to review Arrows and Semicolons, the new EP from friend of the channel, Chalmer Harper. I met Chalmer at Hal Savar's Homegrown Songwriter Showcase a few iterations ago when it was being held at Remix Lounge inside the Strat Casino. Chalmer blew everyone away with his energy and raw vocal power, so I'm looking forward to hearing a studio rendition. But first, are you ready? I mean, really ready? They're not ready. Just checking. Though this EP is only four songs deep, there's plenty of talent and songwriting depth here to showcase what Chalmers' music is all about. Kicking things off with just his vocals to start, we're greeted with Grit, a song Chalmer normally reserves for the end of his set due to its powerhouse sound. Unlike his live performance this time, the listener gets to enjoy some vocal chorus and electric guitar courtesy of Chris Massa. Production-wise, Chalmers' acoustic guitar and vocals are front and center, uh, the latter of which is highlighted in lyrics like, I'm gonna fight, gonna win, ring the bell, let's begin, cause I know I ain't going down. See the fire in my eyes, I'm gonna win the prize, ain't nothing gonna stop me now. Next up is I Will Listen, a ballad that practically begs you to grab a lighter or lit up phone screen and sway back and forth. Reminiscent of Iris by the Goo Goo Dolls from the 90s, this tune touches on the nostalgia centers for anyone who's loved and lost and loved again. With lyrics like, if we take the time, you can share what's on your mind, and I will listen to you. Go from the very start, you can share what's on your heart, and I will listen to you. Won't try to fix in response, I will listen to you. This one is a crowd favorite, and a nice counterpoint to the brash upfrontedness of the first song on the album, Grit. The next track was exclusively played for my viewers live here in Room 6 for Chalmers' interview. If you'd like to be reviewed, interviewed, or both by me, hit me up using my email address or Room 6 social media link down in the description. While you're down there, please consider subscribing and ringing the bell so you don't miss out on awesome content just like Chalmers' performance, uh, reviews, interviews, live streams, and more. Thanks! Speaking of which, the song I just referenced is the cleverly titled play on words, Baby. Aiming for a bit of a rock love anthem here, Chalmer kicks things off with lots of oohs before moving on to the meat of the song. There's a definite emphasis on crowd participation here, though this song could use a little bit of call and response vocals during the chorus, especially with lyrics like, Won't you come on over, baby? Be by my side. I think I need you for the rest of my life. A little closer, baby. Put your hand in mine. I think I'll love you for the rest of my life. Coming up next is Come Back to Me, a straight-ahead love song that gives us a slightly broken-hearted Chalmer. Let's rock! No. This track also shows us that Chalmer is not afraid of the high notes or of the soft notes. And it's a nice change of pace for the album, using lyrics like Defensive, yes I said her name, defenseless, made me feel I am to blame, face in your phone, know who you're talking to, sharing the secrets for me and for you, pouring your heart out, is this how we say goodbye? To emphasize a little more depth to who Chalmer is both as a man and as a songwriter. Finishing out the EP was one of his best received songs when played live. The last track is Under the Sun. With some syncopated drums and simple chords underlying his storytelling, the listener is definitely getting a look into a side of Chalmer his music doesn't usually show. And it's a good thing. Chalmer gets a little topical with this one, discussing multiple current and past issues in lyrics like living paycheck to paycheck, $7 gasoline, Democrats and Republicans, that war in Ukraine, legislating morality and telling us what to do, who to be, who to love, stay out of our bedrooms. It's a nice way to finish out the album. Overall, Arrows and Semicolons by Chalmer Harper is a great look into the heart and soul of a great local songwriter that's only begun to make waves. I'm so glad I got the chance to review it, and I think you'll enjoy it. I think you'll enjoy listening to it over and over. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you'll click the link down in the description for your own copy of Arrows and Semicolons by Chalmer Harper. It is a great EP, and honestly, I think it'll be one of your favorites. In the meantime, if you want to see more videos like this, please click up here. And if you'd like to subscribe, it really does make a difference. Please click down there and don't forget to ring the bell. 
Remember to be amazing, and we'll see you next time on Room 6.